Johnny Nelson. Hi, Todd. Nice to be here with you. It's time now for our tale of the tape. Muhammad Ali, the greatest of all time. Six foot three inches tall, the best to ever do it. And the man he'll be facing, it's the incomparable Roy Jones Jr., 180 centimeters tall with 188 centimeter reach. Talk about hot seats in the house. I am so lucky to be sat where I am watching this fight live. I can tell my grandkids about this. Muhammad Ali, the greatest of all time. Watch the footwork, watch the hand speed. No one does it like Ali. Roy Jones Jr., one of the greatest of all time. Pensacola's finest, an undisputed champion at four different weight classes. As soon as the bell goes, don't blink. That fight could... This bout is scheduled for 12 rounds of boxing. In the red corner, here is the Olympic gold medalist and legend of boxing, the only three-time lineal heavyweight champion of the world. He floats like a butterfly and stings like a bee. The one and only, the greatest, Muhammad Ali. Hiding out of the blue corner from Pensacola, Florida, here is a middleweight, a super middleweight, a light heavyweight, and a heavyweight champion of the world, Roy Jones Jr. Not too many seats to be had in this arena as the hype continues to build for this showdown. I'm so giddy, so excited. The anticipation is second to none. Let's get it on. Good luck. These athletes have promised us a war. Let's see if they deliver. These punches coming from every angle. And he finished the job. Tell he's stronger, but he's not faster. Both of these men showing it. Can he close the show? Pensacola's finest is down. back up on their feet, but I'm not sure why. That is a show of character. When you're put down, your eagle's hurt, your chin's hurt, your body's hurting, and you've got to get up, suck it up, and think right, I'm back in. Can he finish the job? Pensacola's finest is down. point the corner may have to intervene here because this fighter won't final 10 seconds here and I think he knows who's won this round well if this trainer has a pep talk now's the time to use it as they were dropped twice in the last round there's always a way back don't ever run anybody off the bell for round two. Let's see if they can shake off the cobwebs after a disastrous last round. Two knockdowns and you're coming back from that. That's near on impossible because your head must be all over the place. Your legs are feeling like jelly. What can they tell you in the corner? All they can do is wake you up. They can't even go into game plan.
Ryder will say no moss. It looks like we're going to see an early night here. He is rocked. Oh, and that changes everything. And down they go. Make it up, and this fight continues. Nice exchange here from both men. Totally impressed. You know what? You've got skill. You've got... Oh, my goodness. I admire these guys. Both of these men showing exceptional chins, by the way. There it is! A game-changing shot! Neither man really defending themselves. Final 10 seconds here, and I think he knows... Oh, and he caught him clean! Is this the beginning of the end? Not over till it's over, but that knockdown is going to be huge. You've been put down, you've got to think right, survive, and then give it back the next. On to the third. Let's see how he bounces back here after getting dropped in the last round. That knockdown we just saw was a heavy knockdown. I'd be very, very surprised if he'll come out fresh as a daisy. That's not going to happen. He's got a hustle now, he's got a, he's got a bluff. Him. For the finish. Pensacola's finest is down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, you're out. You heard that. Right, ladies and gentlemen, a knockout victory and one of the biggest surprises of the year. Well, there's no argument right there. Not that you say it. Night, night.